Good morning. Hey guys, welcome back to Two Aussie Thrifters. We're going to do another pick and pack for you guys this weekend and show you what we've sold Friday and Saturday and up until about 10 o'clock this morning on Sunday. <laughs> we are also going to show you a couple sales from that bulk lot that we picked up the other week. There's a lot of people commenting on that, wondering if it was the right kind of deal for us. Um, so we're going to keep like a running total of that through the videos to see if it is something we want to do ongoing. All right, the first item that we actually sold from that lot was one of these Oracle card sets. Um, we sold that for $39.95 free postage, so that's a nice one to get out the door. Uh, from that same lot, we've already posted this one out as well. We sold this Logitech Harmony Universal Remote for $29.95 ship. And there is some other things that we've sold in the pick and pack, so we'll try and tally them up as we go as well. All right, first item we need to pick is this Band of Brothers DVD set. We sold that for $24.95. Should be over in this little section over here somewhere. Oh, we spotted it straight away. Oh, it's jammed in there. Nice, so that'll go in a small satchel. So not going to make a heap of money on that one, but good to get some DVDs out the door as well. Okay, next item is this Thunder Force 3 Sega Genesis game. 40 bucks out the door. Should be in this little drawer. Next up is this Adelaide Crow Scarf we picked up from that new Salvage the other week. Paid 5 bucks. That went out at the door for $32.95. Got a Crow's old logo there. Look for that vintage AFL logo. <laughs> Next up is this Genuine N64 transfer pack. We sold that for $18 posted. Should be somewhere in there. Reach. All right, next sale was this Godzilla from our wholesale lot that we picked up. Now it is right up the top there, so Jazzy's gonna have to get a little step stool out. <laughs> but we did manage to sell that for $199.95. We paid $68 for that, so a really good profit on those. They were quite hard to get, so yeah. There's a couple more of the uh, Kongs left, but I think they'll go over Christmas, so nice sale. Okay, another one of these belts out the door, $79.95, this Aaron Williams Stockyard Black Cowhide Leather. Should be in this little box. There's and not right many here. black ones. Looking for 36. Yeah, sweet. Perfect. Right there. Just a manual going out the door for a Game Boy, Kid Icarus, for 15 bucks, free post, so we'll send that untracked. That should be in this little, there we go, just ready to it. Okay, another Dungeon and Dragons book going out the door from that big lot we picked up a while ago. Pay like $3.70 something each for these. Sold that for $159.95. TSR Monstrous Compendium Ravenloft Appendices 1 and 2 should be down in here somewhere. And the ones that don't have a uh, custom skew are the very first ones I did, so they're in the blank one. Okay, look at that. That's so oh, cool. I love it. Two more Warhammer books going out the door for $99.90. Warhammer 40k and Warhammer 40k Codex Imperials. That's Imperials? Yeah. War gear. Rule book. Yeah, that's it. Alright, nice little Blu-ray going out the door. Star Wars Rogue One for $17.95. Rogue One. Yeah, it should be in BR. Rogue One. All right, we had a couple of these PS1s that didn't work, so we sold this one for $40. It doesn't read the disc, but Jazzy has it here. 40 bucks for a broken console. Another CD out the door, $22.95 for this Ice Cube Everything's Corrupt new CD. Everything's Corrupt. Everything. Okay, one of the DVD HDD recorders from that bulk lot has sold for $139.95 plus $20 post. Jazzy's picked it up it there. It one. <laughs> Saw one of those Goosebump board games that we listed the other week. Uh, we sold this one for 40 to a viewer, so shout out to Mitch for buying that one off us. Uh, that one is ready to go already. All right, this was also from that bulk lot that we just picked up the other week. $39.95 for this Lucky Plus card game. It's like you know, It's made by you, the same people that made you know. And that one is right there. Barely got put away. Sold this set of six Nintendo DS games for $39.95 free postage. Should be in the bookshelf somewhere. Happy Feet, Garfield, Super Scribble. Yep. Another thing from that bulk lot we have already sold was these bulk Pokemon marbles, set of three pouches and 23 marbles for 140 bucks. So keep your eye out for those. They should be in the cupboard somewhere. 140? Yeah, for all for three. Weeks. Yeah. Crazy. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right, Street Sharks Guitar. This was in that toy lot we got as part of that bulk deal. So another one out the door, $24.95 sold just for a guitar. So look that, at that little guy. All right, a pair of G-Star Raw shoes going out the door. We've had these for quite a while. I think we paid $14.80. So it just shows everything G-Star doesn't necessarily sell for a good price. So we got 40 bucks in the end. It should be in this box over here somewhere. There's one. There's a dig. 
the other one. DVD going out the door, we sold this Airport 79, the Concord, for $13.99, so not big money on that. I see it. So we'll send that untracked and we'll only make a few dollars on that. Get out. Another book from that bulk lot we picked up a few weeks ago now, $35 for this D20 System Deadlands role-playing game. Should be in F. It's one of the bigger ones. Nice. Well, Pepper's come to join the party. Hi! Okay, we sold this Lorna Jane Full Zip Long Sleeve Grey Hooded Jacket for $50. Should be on the rack there. Oh my god, there's a lot in there. <laughs> Lorna for 50. Yeah, nice to get one out of nice the door. Lorna seems to have dropped off a little bit, so we're not yeah. really picking a lot of that up at the moment, but 50 on that, happy to get it up. This set of three Tim Burton DVDs sold for 25 bucks. When they're lower value, we like to bundle them up by like producer or director or artist, so they should be up in E. I think that's them right here. Beetlejuice. Night Before Christmas, and is it Sweeney Todd? Okay, another item from that bulk lot we picked up the other week. This X-Men Projectors Magneto sold for $23, including post. Look at his cape. What a dude. <laughs> another CD going out for 15 bucks. This LCD Sound System American CD sold for $15. Time to go on the shed, and it is windy and overcast, so... There's also a huntsman in here somewhere, <laughs> so if you hear a scream... He was up here the other night, so he doesn't seem to be there at the moment, so we'll just assume that he's left the building. <laughs> oh, please! So blusterous! Oh, I'm scared! Okay, first item we need from the shed is this Aaron Williams women's long sleeve button-up shirt, size 12, should be in J, Jasmine. It's like a white one, so it should sort of stand out quite a lot. Like oh, she needs a steam. Yeah. 12? 12. Alright, next item out the door is this pair of Carhartt men's light brown cotton blend Sid pant that sold for $44.95. That should be an LR13. We got them for like $3, like Ooh. when we went south that time, not $3 long ago. Carhartt? Yes, please. Sold another RM Williams top, brand new with tags, size 10. The Burgundy Grazier should be in RM4. Oh, yes. 10? 10. Beautiful. Oh, so little. Another RM Williams item going out the door. This Clara pleated maxi skirt sold for $65 and it should be in V. If you're looking for size 10. We're going to go through and like refold some of this stuff. Hey, like, over time no. it's just kind of. <laughs> It's either dig or you put it all in bags, and I prefer to do the work once I've gotten the money. <laughs> Size 10. We have a winner! We sold this vintage Aaron Williams women's red moleskin long sleeve shirt. We sold that, where, sorry, we picked that up for 16 bucks, so we did pay up, but sold it for 75 so that should be in LR2. I can see already how I reckon it's that one there. Drag it out. Yeah, beautiful. Look at that. Very nice. That was quick. A pair of G-Star going out. Women's, they were a small size, so we took 42 on offer on those. I think we paid 9 initially. Uh, they should be in Lee L1 to 8. Skinny jeans are out. Flares are in. Who would have thought? Uh, you're looking for size 24, and they are the women's high flare. High flare, 24. Beautiful. Fashion. Sold this Hang 10 uh, Polo. We picked this up for like $4.99 a couple weeks ago at Savers and sold it for $39. Jazzy's got the uh, Nerf gun here. Uh, that one is in L23. Oh, so this is my most recent tub. <laughs> Five into 39 very quickly. Another Harley Davidson going out that we picked up in that bulk lot. Oh, we just sold some a belt, I think. That's nice. Get in line. Uh, yeah, so we sold this Harley Davidson women's white skull long sleeve, $45. It's in white. It's actually going overseas, so we made a bit more on that one. Uh, we picked this up in a bulk lot, uh, well, from wholesale really, and they've been ticking through. So we are making a little bit less than you'd make from a thrift store, but we're still making sort of 10 to 15 bucks on that after everything. Listed a lot of white Harley this day, apparently. 
So that's our sales from Friday and Saturday and a little bit of this morning. For those mm -hmm. that are following along with that bulk lot that we purchased, we are now up to 457.75 in sales in about a week. So And still listing. Yeah, we still have a lot to list from that. So that's a good little start. Let us know in the comments below what your favorite sale from this haul was. Or what your favorite sale was that you've had over the weekend. And we will see you next week on Twasy Thrifters. Bye for now.